Hey gang, Tony here with another official review from Diamond Select Toys. This time I am reviewing the Alien Vinyl Bank. Now this guy is pretty damn spiffy. I... I... This is one of those situations where it's just like, I love it so much that the sculpt is, is beautiful, the uh, attention to detail is beautiful, and uh, I'm just super happy with everything about this, this uh, particular bank, except for the fact that it's a bank. Again, kind of like, kind of like with the Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, I'm not entirely sure I'll ever use it as a bank, but it is just a beautiful bust uh, display piece that goes really well with any of your alien figurines. And again, specifically the mini mates would be kind of cool to go around this particular guy. There are a couple little things that I was sort of um, kind of on the fence about, I guess. The first is the placement of the coin slot for the bank. So. It was pretty ridiculous. I took like 10 minutes looking for the coin slot. I just could not find it for some reason. And then I eventually found it on the side of the neck, right, right in here, which is sort of behind this outcropping. And at first I was like, well, that's, that's kind of strange placement. I, I don't really like that. It's, it's really hidden. And I was like, wait a minute it's hidden. That's actually brilliant because you don't, it doesn't appear to be a, ba a bank on first glance. You really don't see the coin slot. It's, it's camouflaged in a sense. So I was like, well, that, that actually makes a whole lot of sense. I, I, I like that now. So yeah, first I was like, ah, what's going on here? And then I kind of came around on the idea of it. And just to kind of test this out, I haven't done this yet, but I figure why not actually try out the bank, right? So, being that the coin slot is sort of behind there, I wanted to see if coins would easily go in. I'm pretty sure they will. I imagine this is something that was tested, but just want to give it a shot. Yeah, not a problem. Coins go right in. So, you get the best, uh, the best of both, both worlds here in the sense that it's a really cool camouflage hidden coin slot but easy to get the money in if you do want to use this as a bank. Which brings me to the bottom. The bottom is where the uh, opening is for the bank. Now with the Stay Puff Marshmallow Man, you might remember the head, the whole head comes off in order to get the money out. This, I, I like this a little better, I think, where you have the, um, where you have the actual safe sort of uh, component. So it twists and locks. You place it on and then twist it and it locks it in to place and then twist it again, pull it off and shake the bank and the money will eventually come out. <laughs> and this is actually something I wanted to, to test out because I was looking on the inside of this guy and uh, you could just tell from looking at the figure that there are a lot of like areas that coins can possibly get caught. So I am noticing as I'm trying to get the coins out, one came out so far, I think I put three in there. It's, you know, the coins get a little stuck in there maybe. Got my coins. All right, so they will eventually come out. And this is definitely nitpicking, but it, a little bit of an annoyance was that the bottom was covered with a sticker and when I uh, took the sticker off, there was a lot of like residual uh, sticker stickiness, and I kind of tried to get it off, and I, you know, I washed it with um, with uh, alcohol and scrubbed it a little bit, and there still was it was not the easiest sticker to get off, I guess is what I'm saying, which of course is just a nitpick, but something you know that it, you could be aware of. If I was not doing a review of this, I probably would have left the sticker on there because, again, I'm not really planning on using it as a bank. But for the purposes of the review, I wanted to take that off and show you guys the bottom. So if you're buying this just as a display piece, again, that, that probably wouldn't matter too much. At the end of the day, I love this piece. 
besides the little nitpicks that I had about the uh, the coins inside and the sticker on the bottom, otherwise this is just a beautiful display piece, a beautiful bank. Uh, I can't say enough good things about it to be honest with you, and it's going to be a permanent fixture in my uh, display case. So, again, highly recommend this one. And if you want to see the other Diamond Select banks or this particular one, I'll have all the links below. Hit those and you could snag one for yourself. The Alien Warrior Vinyl Bus Bank can be had for a mere $22.99 and found on Diamond Select Toys website. Again, link below for that. And come check me next time for another review from Diamond Select Toys. Have a good one, everybody. Hush, little baby, don't say a word. Mama's gonna buy you a mockingbird. And if that mockingbird won't sing, Mama's gonna buy you a diamond.